Hello everyone, my name is Wildan and I am Hudafa. We are year 5 students from the next generation school, Doha, Qatar. Today we will share our journey on our scientific research. For scientific research, our topic is getting excessive food from trash to plates. We will share our research journey with you that includes reading various books and having fruitful discussions with experts, teachers and with our friends. For the better understanding and in-depth study of the topic, we refer to relevant websites and read articles that have authored on this topic. Food, a much of an ingredient in everyone's life is getting wasted without being used, resulting in 841 million people going hungry all around the world. According to UN Environment Program, at least one third of the world food which is made for consumption is getting lost or wasted every single year. In our discussion with Mr. Salman Zafar, who is an expert on food waste management and founder of Ecomina, we found that roughly half of the waste in Qatar's landfills are leftover food, which produce undesired greenhouse gases contributing to global warming and climate change. In Qatar, about half of municipal garbage is discarded food. Food waste is a major problem in the world, especially in a country like Qatar, which imports 90% of its food. This research is aimed to create an awareness of the possibility of using food waste as energy. For food waste is not a waste but a resource. And we want to promote different ways of recycling and, and composting food waste. It is high time for us to take action and become a part of the solution instead of being a part of the problem. We have a huge opportunity to secure our environment, society and economy if we have a sustainable management of food waste. We propose that to reduce wastage of food and to utilize this waste as a resource through recycling and composting, the following measures can be implemented. Source reduction the first basic way to curtail food waste is to simply produce, import and buy less whenever overproduction and overstocking is clearly leading to waste. Food donation program. When excessive foodstuffs are still edible, they can be shared with the poor who cannot even afford sufficient food from today's high priced economy because the only acceptable number when it comes to hunger should be zero. Recycle by composting. We as responsible creatures of our planet can solve 100% of our food waste problems by simply organizing an effective composting strategy at a very initial stage in our homes. By recycling, we can eliminate environmental impact of food waste. Verbal interviews and online surveys were done by teachers, students and with others to identify the awareness level in our society about recycling the food waste. The interview with Mr. Salman helped us to learn more about the causes of food waste and very low recycling rate in Qatar. He told us how we can reduce the harmful impacts of food waste through recycling and this we can easily start doing in our homes. It is dependent on imported foods for its, uh, uh, to feed the population. So uh, it's, uh, they are dependent on mass production of food to feed the masses and uh, we have lack of locally grown produce. So the, 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 this solution, the solution is to have some sort of indigenous agricultural, which can help in uh, augmenting the food security in the region and uh, 
having uh, local farmers produce the crops that are, that can be consumed by the population an awareness campaign was started in school where people were informed about the benefits of managing food waste and taking simple action more than 25 people took a stand against food waste and volunteered to voice out by registering with wahab